What is going on YouTube? This is Arctic Fox. Welcome back to the channel. Today we're going to take a look at a little bit of a cold case. This one dates all the way back to 2003 when a five-year-old young lady disappeared unexpectedly from her home in the city of Chisholm, Minnesota on June the 14th of 2003. That young lady's name is Leanna Warner. The five-year-old just kind of vanished from her home in Chisholm. And in the time since she's been missing, there's been a number of theories pop up. It could have been a kidnapping. Was she murdered? We do know that she had been seen heading back to her house from one of her friend's house. The young lady still has not been found. We're talking about a five-year-old little girl. And during the years, like I said... Certain individuals have put out various speculations, including her being abducted and murdered, but no one has put out a substantial, credible lead to this date. The case did get a lot of media attention back then, especially from the local neighborhood media. It did kind of get cold for a little bit, and then it got worldwide attention when People Magazine started taking a look at the case in an attempt to tackle what happened to Leanna. So, what did happen to her? Well, we don't really know. Again, the theories circulate anything from abduction to murder. But after 19 years, we still don't really know. Now, her mom has posted some speculation on Facebook that she's getting a lot of messages where individuals are saying that they've seen Leanna. But be that as that may, the local law enforcement hasn't given any credibility to Kaylin's assertion. Um, you know, it's been a very damaging time for the family, and I can assure you that if Leanna is still out there, after 19 years, she probably has been seen by some people. And I can assure you that law enforcement in the area is following up on the tips as they come in. But, you know, the main reason why I want to put this video up is that I want to help heat the case up. Obviously, after 19 years, the case has started to grow cold. And I've also had some subscribers ask if I would cover the case. And, you know, I try to cover any case that my subscribers ask for me to take a look at. So, Kay so Leanna's parents, Kaylin and Christopher, they were recently separated. They had met and moved in with each other towards the end of 1996. And Kaylin gave birth to Leanna on the 21st of January, 1998. They moved to Chisholm a couple of months before Leanna went missing. And afterward, they left the city and moved somewhere else to begin a new life. At present, they are still living in Minnesota. So, Leanna was only five years old when she disappeared, and throughout this entire time that she's been gone, the police have been attempting to figure out the case. They have investigated over 1,700 leads. However, they are yet to make any progress or substantial progress in the investigation. They really believe that she was abducted, but they don't have any type of substantial proof for that theory. Um, till now, the police have led various searches in the city, but they have never gotten any type of hint as to what happened to Leanna. So the case really remains a mystery. And so, you know, it's important. We see it all the time. These cases initially will get a lot of coverage in the local area from time to time. That's in some cases. Sometimes the case doesn't get any media coverage at all, and that's all too often the case as well. But Leanna's case did get some media coverage at first. But, you know, we're talking about 19 years that she's been missing. And in that time, there's been several children go missing, be recovered, 
so on and so forth. And what happens so often is that these older cases, like this one, get completely forgotten about. People stop covering the child altogether. And when that happens, that's when the case starts to get cold. And so I'm hoping that I can shine a new light on Leanna's case. This was a five-year-old little girl. And, and by all accounts, she was loved by her family. So we need to figure out what happened to her. So do me a favor, help me shine a new light on Leanna's case. If you look at your screen to the right hand side, you will see an age progress photo of what Leanna may look like today. Give the video a like. It does help more people to see Leanna and to hear her story. Also, you know, if you're not subscribed to the channel, consider doing so. It does help the channel out. And if you ring that notification bell, you'll always be alerted when I post new content. But the most important thing that I'm asking for all of you to do is to simply click that share button. Share this to your Facebook, your Twitter, your Instagram, wherever you have social media. Guys, it only takes a second of your time to do. And it could mean everything in the world and making a difference as to whether we finally bring closure to what happened to Leanna Warner or not. As always, guys, I do want to thank you so much for tuning in and watching. I appreciate each and every single one of you. Y'all be kind to one another out there, and I'll see you real soon in the next video.